the action-packed original net animation Tekken. Bloodline is a component of the Tekken multimedia brand. Before becoming a loose adaptation of the latter game, the tale starts in the interim time between the timelines of Tekken 2 and Tekken 3. Jin Kazama is raised by his mother, Jun, who teaches him the Kazama fighting style and the philosophy that underlies it. In a community on an island where life is generally pleasant, an entity known as Ogre pursues Jin after he gets into a fight with a bunch of neighborhood bullies. Before giving her life to save Jin, Jun instructs her son to seek his paternal grandfather, Hihachi Mishima. Jin meets Hihachi, who at first is disdainful of him, but after learning about Ogre, he consents to teach Jin Mishima fighting techniques so that he will be ready the following time the creature manifests. Tekken Bloodline earned mixed to favorable reviews after its release. The fighting scenes and animation both received accolades. In this video, we answer your question on whether Tekken Bloodline will have a second season. Tekken Bloodline Season 2 Release Date Season 1 of Tekken Bloodline debuted on Netflix on August 18, 2022. It has six episodes with runs between 22 and 30 minutes. The project was created by Lark's Entertainment and Studio Hibari. This is all we know thus far about Season 2. The creation of a second season has not yet been announced by the anime creators or Netflix officials. Netflix has a long history of creating and funding animated video game-based projects, though. Anime and animated episodes based on video games, such as Castlevania, Dota, Dragon's Blood, Dragon's Dogma, and Resident Evil Infinite Darkness make up a sizable chunk of Netflix's repertoire at any given time, particularly Castlevania and Dota. Dragon's Blood have found success on a global scale, inspiring the creation of numerous seasons for each program. A second season of Tekken, Bloodline is a possibility if it can even come close to matching the popularity of Castlevania. The anime is a loose adaptation of Tekken 3, as was already mentioned. As of August 2022, the main Tekken series has four additional games along with numerous spin-offs. There is, therefore, more than enough content to create several seasons of Tekken, Bloodline. Viewers can anticipate the release of Tekken. Bloodline Season 2 in Q4 2024 if the show gets renewed in the coming months. Tekken. Bloodline Season 2 plot. What can it be about? It is revealed in Season 1 that a number of other elite fighters, excluding Jun, have vanished. Hihachi chooses to host the third King of Iron Fist tournament, assuring Jin that it will attract the entity's attention after concluding that this was done by Ogre. He is aware that four years ago, Ogre was drawn to Jin's devil gene. Jin goes on to win the competition and, by partially accepting the consequences of his devil gene, even defeats Hihachi. As a result, Ogre makes a comeback, which Jin ends by killing. Jin is shot by Hihachi, causing him to fully turn into devil Jin. Jin refrains from killing Hihachi and instead flies away in his devil form, keeping in mind his mother's teachings. It's possible that Season 2 will adapt the video game Tekken 4. Kazuya, Jin's father, will probably be shown to be still alive. He was revived in video games by the biotech company G Corporation. Both Kazuya and Jin are likely to take part in the fourth King of Iron Fist tournament if Hihachi hosts it. It's also likely that one of the supporting figures from the first season, such as Paul Phoenix, Nina Williams, H. Warang or Ling Xiaoyu would play a significant role in the second season. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, make sure to like and subscribe for more.